Hi guys, so welcome to my channel. So ngayon, itetest natin yung ating budget PC. Yung ating uh, 25k budget PC na ginawa natin uh, last month. Kasi meron mga nagre-request na itry daw natin yung mga specific games tayo nung COD uh, Grand Theft Auto. So ngayon, tinest natin yung PC dun sa mga uh, requested games. And so meron din mga gusto na itry siya for streaming. So ngayon, uh, try natin mag-stream and para makita natin yung performance niya, yung FPS niya while doing streaming. Okay? Kasi yung build natin is uh, sinabi natin na streaming, gaming, and video editing build siya. So ngayon, test natin sa uh, live streaming. Okay? So ngayon, balikan muna natin yung PC. So yung PC natin is uh, worth 25k more or less. So yung CPU natin na ginamit is the Ryzen 2600. So meron siyang um, 6 core 12 threads. So pinair natin siya sa B450 motherboard. So yung GPU natin RX 570 by AMD Radeon. So 500 watts power supply. So yung RAM na ginamit natin dito is uh, the G-Skill 16 gigabyte. 2666 MHz na RAM. So storage naman is the 256 uh, M.2 NVMe and a 2 terabyte hard drive. So yun yung buong system natin. So pagdating sa, sa GPU guys, so marami nagtatanong kung pwede natin palitan yung GPU to a higher um, GPU. So marami nang sasuggest kung pwede natin palitan yung GPU in case na meron silang budget. So, kung meron kayong budget guys, sa Ryzen 5 2600, pwede natin pair yung mga newer GPU. Kung meron kayong extra budget and you want to go uh, NVIDIA, you can go to, um, you can try the 1650 or the 1660 Super. Or kung mas uh, preferred nyo is AMD, you can go to 5500 XT. Or even the 5600 XT when you are going for 1080p gaming pero if you are going to uh, try uh, 2k or yung ating 1440p gaming so you can even try 5700 xd with the ryzen 5 2600 okay kung meron kayo extra budget kasi when it comes to a uh, 2k or 1440p yung mga games natin will be more gpu bound so ngayon try natin for streaming at sa ibang games tong ating budget pc I-retest natin yung PC using uh, the out-of-the-box setting niya. So, babaguhin lang natin is the uh, XMP. So, kasi 2666 MHz yung ating RAM. So, kung di natin i-activate or i-on si XMP, so it will only run at 2333 MHz. So, yun lang yung binago natin. So, everything is the same or default setting like it is out of the box so let's try it out guys so ngayon itetest muna natin is the GTA 5 
natin is the shadow of the Tomb Raider. Hi guys, so as requested, so gagawa tayo ng, um, ng test streaming para sa ating um, budget 25k PC. So gusto nila makita yung performance while streaming ng ating gaming PC. Okay, so ngayon test na natin. So bali, so na set up ko na siya. So test down natin. Um, so test down natin yung Call of Duty Warzone while streaming. Gusto daw nila makita yung FPS and yung performance. So, yung program na gagamit natin for streaming is OBS. So, na-setup ko na siya. So, yung mga open na program, 
So, for reference lang, so yung mga na-open na program is OBS, so yung MSI Afterburner para makita natin FPS, so yung mga naka-open, so yung Battle.net, so Modern Warfare, and isang browser para uh, makita natin yung, um, so yung browser, so syempre mag-live tayo, and so mamaya bubuksan ko rin yung uh, window game bar para uh, itatry ko na rin record at the same time. So, so, so for recap guys, so ang ating system spec is, ang ating CPU is the AMD Ryzen 5 2600, ang ating GPU is the Radeon RX 570, motherboard is the uh, GAB450M S2H, so, so yung ating RAM is the G-Scale uh, 266 MHz, 16GB DDR4 RAM So ang ating storage is the XPG Spectrix So it is a 256 NVMe M.2 SSD And a 2TB HDD So ngayon, tetest na natin Let's go live guys So hi guys, so welcome to my channel Peters TV So ngayon, gagawin natin ay isang test streaming ng ating gaming 25k PC so yung ating render resolution try natin i 100% lang so the same resolution ng ating monitor so texture size so iba i normal lang natin para at least uh, nasa medyo magandang FPS pa rin tayo sa 1080 so sa 1080p gaming so RX 570 so think ko yun na yung pinaka budget um, na na GPU So ngayon, we are running at 80, 80 to 90 FPS. Siguro kung i-close niya ibang mga program, siguro medyo makakano pa kayo na medyo mataas na, na FPS. So, so we are currently sitting at 80 to 90 FPS. So takbo-takbo lang tayo hangga't hindi pa nahanap ng baril. Meron talaga maglaro habang nagsasalita, guys. Talo na. So, yun guys. So, around 70 to 90 FPS. So, around 80 average FPS tayo sa ating basic gaming PC. So, if ever na gusto nyo mag-upgrade ng parts, so, i-depende nyo lang sa kung anong gagawin nyo. So, kung gaming lang kayo, then go for a better GPU. Pero kung more on gaming streaming kayo, meron kayong extra budget. So, B3. So, yung ating Ryzen 5 3600. So, maganda rin siyang option. 
kung gusto niyo parang mas powerful na na graphic card na na CPU so go for B3600 pero kung more on gaming lang talaga kayo and you want a good FPS so magandang image quality so bili kayo ng mas magandang GPU kung 1080p gaming lang kayo so 1650 super or 5500 XT so yun yung magandang choice okay so kung nag-iisip kayo kung merong uh, future uh, pathway future upgrade pathway dito sa ating build so napakaraming uh, pathway okay so depende lang talaga sa budget nyo and kung saan nyo gagamitin yung inyong PC build okay guys So, yun. So, doon na nagtatapos. So, sa mga gustong makita kong yung uh, performance niya in gaming and streaming. So, ito na po yun. So, ginawa na po natin. So, kung makikita nyo naman na kayang-kaya niya capable talaga siya sa gaming and streaming at the same time. So, ito yung ginaga yung may-ari nito. Ginagamit niya to more on video editing. So, masabi ko sa inyo, capable talaga to sa video editing. So, ang ginagamit niya software is uh, Window Filmora 9 and uh, Premiere Pro and Photoshop. So, so kaya ang kaya niya. So, kung di nyo pa na uh, nalalike at nasasubscribe yung ating uh, sponsor nitong ating PC, nagpagawa sa atin si Charlene Dayan Manalo. So, I will link uh, her YouTube channel below. So, Okay, so gagawin nating uh, video. So yun guys, so thank you sa panonood at sa mga nag-request. So keep the comment coming. So yung mga comments niyo sasagutin natin lahat 'yan kung meron kayong katanungan. So so abang-abang lang kayo guys sa mga bagong videos ko lalo na dun sa ating mga bagong build. So medyo busy lang tayo mga nakarang araw dahil nagsimula na yung pasukan sa trabaho. So ngayon, so medyo nakakanap nulta ko ng time. So, yung next build natin, so, gawa ko ng Intel build, so, budget Intel build. So, sa June, second week, so, try natin yung bagong uh, Ryzen uh, CPU. So, yun guys, so, thank you for watching. So, yun guys, so, thanks. So, signing off.